Google Docs is perfect for anyone who doesn't want to waste cash on a Microsoft subscription. If you're a student typing up a long and important paper, you'll probably have to put all of your citations in as you go and add a bibliography towards the end. If you're using Docs, here's how to do it. To start, you'll have to be editing your document using a desktop or laptop computer on the program's web editor. Once your document is loaded up, click on Tools from the menu at the top and select Citations to open your citation bar. Click on the drop-down menu to select a citation format. Currently, you can choose between APA 7th edition, MLA 8th edition, and Chicago author date 17th edition. If you need to cite sources using another format, you'll have to do so manually. If you can use one of these three, click on Add Citation Source to begin. Select a source type and fill in the information required. Essential fields are marked with an asterisk. Once you're done, click on Add Citation Source and it'll be ready for use. If you ever need to edit a source, just hover over it, click on the triple dotted icon that appears, and select Edit. Once you've made your edits, click on Save Source at the bottom of the sidebar. You can also delete a source from the same menu. Any changes made here will not reflect on your document automatically. When you need to insert an in-text citation, just place your cursor where it needs to appear, then hover over the source you want to cite in the citation's sidebar. A cite button will appear to the side of the source. Click it, and the source will appear in your selected style. If a pound symbol appears in the added citation, delete it or replace it with the page numbers for your citation. If you need to add a bibliography near the end of your paper, just place your cursor where you need it to appear, then mouse over to your citation sidebar and click Insert Bibliography at the bottom. Google Docs will then insert a bibliography in your selected format. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Docs and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.